The ASPCA Animal Poison Control has the world's largest database of poisons to pets and animals, and every year they publish their top 10 list. Consistently, human over-the-counter and prescription medications rank first and second on the list every year. Advil, ibuprofen, Tylenol. Dogs eat everything. They love getting into snacks and candy. It's really common for dogs to ingest entire bottles of Advil and other medications. Never give any human medications to your pet without first consulting a veterinarian. Even a single dose of naproxen or Aleve can be fatal to a dog. The same thing goes for Tylenol and cats. Even topical preparations, if ingested by a pet, can cause harm. Non-drowsy formulations of antihistamines contain dangerous uppers, and these can cause seizures and cardiac arrhythmia arrhythmias, even death. Recreational drug intoxication is the most common emergency that we see here in Whistler. Most of the time, these exposures they happen in public recreation areas like parks, bike trails, and hiking trails, campsites, and beaches. So if you are with a pet in one of these public areas, make sure that you supervise them very closely. Toxic foods ranks third. There are so many foods in a household that can be toxic to your pet. Xylitol is an artificial sweetener. It's found in everything these days. This can cause liver failure in dogs. Grapes and and raisins can cause kidney injury in dogs. Onions and garlic can cause hemolytic anemia. And chocolate, because of the caffeine-like compounds, can lead to cardiac arrhythmia, seizures, and even death if a dog ingests enough of it. Unleavened bread, if a dog eats that, they can become intoxicated because of the alcohol that's produced. The dough can swell in their stomach, leading to major problems and complications. Mold, like the mold that grows on moldy cheese, can contain toxins that can cause neuro logic signs and tremors. There are other foods in the household that can pose hazards. Pets can also become intoxicated by veterinary labeled products if they're not given appropriately or according to the label. Because a lot of chewable medications are flavored, dogs get into their own medications and eat the entire bottle and this can be very dangerous as well. So ivermectin is a deworming medication used in livestock. Flea products, especially dog products that are applied to cats can be very dangerous. Household toxins like ethylene glycol, which is also called antifreeze or engine coolant, can cause kidney failure and death. Paint, adhesives, and spackle. There's quite a few dogs every year that ingest glue and other adhesives, and some of these can be very dangerous. Pennies can cause zinc toxicity. Play-Doh has excessive amounts of salt in it, and this can actually lead to neurologic problems and death. Carbon monoxide is odorless, tasteless gas. Rodent poisons you should avoid altogether. So many pets end up in our emergency every year for ingestion ingesting rodent poisons that were left out either by businesses or in residential areas. These poisons are not only a threat to pets and small children, but they are also a major threat to wildlife. Rodent poisons are now a leading cause of death in birds of prey like owls and eagles, and even the chicks can die from being fed rodents that had ingested poison. The toxic plants, if you have a cat, just don't bring any lilies into your home. These can cause kidney failure, even just a couple licks of the pollen or the water can make your cat very sick or even die. Cycad palms can cause liver failure in dogs. Poisonous mushrooms. Insect poisons, are especially snail baits, we'll cover in more depth in the third section of our curriculum how to respond to intoxications and what to do.